<laughs> Eat the villagers, murder bunnies, milk cows, or exterminate gods. I mean, that's... I don't think I've ever had a, a better selling point for a game than that right there. <laughs> so, Soul Ash has been around for a little while. Um, as of... I say a little while. As of a couple days ago, it's now on Steam. Uh, they... He, Arthur here... Um, made this one. It's been on itch.io for a long time. I played a very early build of it on, on itch. I think I've played a more recent build of it as well. Um, and uh, he like hired a graphic artist. They did a Kickstarter through it. It did not It did not succeed on Kickstarter, but he still continued with it. And here we are now. Now, now we, have, uh, we have a game. So the game's all about, we are a god. We're like a long forgotten god that was like banished or something. And um, we're angry. Um, as we should be. So what do we do when we're angry? Well, we go around, we we eat the villagers, we murder bunnies, we milk cows, and exterminate gods. That's, that's what we do. Um, so there's there's a wide variety of different kinds of gods we can be. We can be a necromancer or like a, a an automaton, and there's a, a plethora of things. And um, big map uh, on this thing. There was a demo also this a few days ago, which is like a little map. This is a big map. Um, and uh, judging by the screenshots, we can make our own maps. Is that what's going on over here? I think so. Um, anyway, made by this this one guy and now uh, a graphic or art, an artsy person. Um, but there is a demo on Steam, but it is available now for uh, for for buy-in in version one point So uh, I've I've really been looking forward to this one. I have I have had it on my um, on my to play list for quite a while. But looking forward to to this day. This um, this full release day because I really liked I liked the ASCII version of this back when it came out. But I'm kind of a I'm kind of a strange one, I suppose. Um, when letters mean mean something to me when I play games, um, but you know for for uh, for for the common folk, we got pictures now, and it does look good though. <laughs> it is it is pretty nice. Pictures are great. All right, uh, let's go and uh, do a. Let me see if this works. Uh, there we go. <sighs> Can't be that strange. I still play Dwarf Fortress and ASCII and on mod and Rackith. You know, you're, you're you're a special one. That's what it is. Okay, so I think we're all set here. It's a little small. Got some nice nice music. Can you hear it? We can make the tile size a little bigger, but I think we're going to leave it as it... Well, maybe we should... We'll leave it. We'll leave it. We'll leave it. Uh, what was that? Hobble the Hebel. Thank you for the follow. Okay, so uh, we are going to make ourselves a person. So uh, we're going to be on Tinty. And uh, choose what kind of... What my race is and what my profession is before we charge through here. The, really, the only goal is... Um, is to go around. We're going to eat things and kill things and and take their souls and use those souls to empower ourselves to go eventually go to kill some gods, I think is the ultimate goal. But there's like different maps and different areas we can go. So we have a lot of stuff. Um, we can be a human. We can be a dark dwarf, um, a goblin. And you can see with each of these, it's kind of small, but with each of these, you can see different stats like dexterity and endurance with the goblin. They can see in the dark. They're sneaky. Um, we've got a dark elf. Also is dexterous and all that. Praise on Tinti is right. Uh, we have a vampire. We have a troll. A bone wraith. An enigmatic race of bone-like beings takes various forms, each living art created by their bone crafter. They go through painful transformations to assimilate more bones and gain prestige. The society is matriarchal, where clans and tribes are the primary groups in their culture. Focus on acquiring the best bones to make the most potent members. Their strength and rarity of their bones determine the position in the clan. I like the sound of that. We begin with a trident. Uh, we have a recipe of trident. There is crafting in here. We uh, the strength. Uh, what was that? The strength plus two, endurance plus two, plus twenty five percent two handed melee weapon damage. So we're a, we are a trident kind of guy. We'll look at the other ones, but that's 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 a strong contender for my choice. Uh, we have lizardmen. We have demons. Uh, we have Racimi, which are cat people. We have a Lich, which I've played as a Lich before. We have an Orc. Uh, we also have more. We have a Golem. Uh, I played the demo as an Abomination. Right? No, no. I played as the, as the Golem. 
And the golem it doesn't need to eat. The golem eats materials like wood and whatever to, to eat, essentially. Uh, we have an abomination, which is Frankenstein's monster. Uh, we, have a, we have a genie. Uh, we have a knoll. What the genie do? We have a decorated collar. Creatures appear magic infused with a motif. Motive will? A motif will? Motive will? Uh, these ancient beings once dwelt plentifully in the deserts and ruled the sands through an ancient war, saw their entire race enslaved for their power. The jinn, uh, the genie are incredibly rare. I mean, that's 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 a selling point. Let's do an abomination. They require fresh meat. Uh, produces throwable rotten meat on consumption of fresh meat. Yeah, I like it. And I think I'm going to want some... I'm going to want... The ability to raise zombies. I don't know what determines that. Improve fatigue regeneration during sleep. Stamina, health regen per tick. Um, let's take... I think I just need... I don't know, if I'm, I don't know what I'm going to... I think I'm just going to be raising my armies and letting them do all the work. So let's take an intelligence. Non-physical damage. Let's do that. A little bit of willpower. Okay, so we are a an abomination necromancer. We begin with a hat. Long Venter. Uh, I played a little bit of it. I didn't. I didn't do it on the channel, but I played a little bit. Um, uh, just on my own. It was. It's a little weird. Hey, Fresh Castle, going? Yeah, this is this is a uh, pokey. This is this is traditional roguelike. No carry it. That's that's a kind of that's a roguelite kind of thing where you carry things over the next the next phase. Um, so we we play until until we die. So I think I want to throw out this right. I put this on the ground, and then I say, let's back up and then raise that zombie. <laughs> yes. Stop that. What do I have? Do I have a weapon in my hands? I don't. Okay, I'm gonna let my zombie do the work then. Get him, zombie. Good job. Die. Zombie number two. Excellent. Okay. Okay. Do I have an option to command you guys? Do I have a, an ability to do that? What's the tutorial? Oh. Um, so command allies. Granger allies will attack targets in selected positions. So I want this to be there. Can we say, like, command your, your zombies to move. All right. Yeah. There we go. Little bat zombies. I'll take some damage here. It's okay. Be a real problem getting fresh meat whenever I'm trying to uh, turn that into zombies. What are these things gonna have? I'm gonna rest until healed. You know what? You go, go do it, zombies. Die! Hey, Dark Ray, thank you very much. Uh -uh. Thanks everyone for all the subs tonight. Um. Anyway, anyway, speaking of of Long Venter, I started speaking of it a little bit. Um. It's sort of like it's like the Animal Crossing with guns. Is basically what it's like. It's it's weird. Um, it didn't quite play out like I was expecting. It played out kind of like you. Ex actually, I should say it played out like I expected, not like I hoped. Um, basically. Hey, wait, get him. He's getting him whenever I whenever I attack it first. So we'll let's go run around, grab something. What's down there? Feathered humanoid creature that has features of a raven. They often imitate what they hear like a parrot. Oh, okay. Um, ooh, what are you? I feel like maybe I shouldn't look in there. It's a tomb. Let's let's rest until heal first. There's a game coming out this year with basically this Pokemon with guns. What's it called? I don't seem to rest very quickly. Yeah, we'll rest. Then we'll, we'll open this tomb up and see what's in there. Pow. 
Howl World. Uh, oh, you know what? I, th I think I know what you're talking about. Yeah, and that's, that's, that's kind of how um, how Long Venter was. So it looks like um, it looks like Animal Crossing, but you get guns and you go around and it's TV it's it's PVP. How do I open this thing? I want to open it. Can I rest here? Oh, I already rest. Uh, can we push it? Hmm. Fine. Fine. So I'm going to go talk to the bird people. I think we're going to stay up here and and head out. What are these? Forgotten altar. All right. More tombs. Maybe that's what I came out of. This is down a level down there. Another bat over here. Let's go get this guy. Where my zombies at? Go get him. Stop chewing on me. that guy up. I think it said I can have 14. Is that what it said? Or did it even say that? It said something 14. I don't know what that was, though. Okay. Nice. See if there's a limit. Yeah, keep on raising them, if I can. Where do we go here? Oh, there's downstairs. Okay. I think we are going to these bird people. How do we go down? Craw, they say. Um, where are my zombies at? Here they come. Are they clicking because of my footsteps? Is that what's going on? How tough are they? Uh, where is it? 45 hit points? You know, I wish I had some sort of spell. That'd be real nice. I'm real dependent on these, these, uh, these zombies. Like a necromancer. No dying, okay? Ooh, hey, I'll pick this rock up and I'll throw it at you. Yes. Uh, T? Take that! One point! Ahoy there, matey. Who's that? Bachelor, thank you very much. Five months! Necro Nook. Well, you know, I like to mix things up every once in a while. Okay, let's do some raisin zombies. Hey, this one, where's the one at? There he is. Get out of the way, buddy. I got a zombie to raise. Ouch. Ooh, pick that up and throw it at him. Do I have to equip it every time? Never mind. Another one? Give me that, and Nine. get out of the way, buddy. Nine. Okay. Nine. Okay. Yeah, we got. A no we even have a necromancer. Uh, emote. So I think we're in. I've seen this start before. We're in like one of these caves that we saw before. It's like that right there. So that is, that's coal. I think that's what that is. Coal vein. So, you know, we could get a pickaxe and go mining. If we so wished. Uh, there's some gold over there. How do we get out of this place? Hey, buddy. Um, take that. I have... Let's put this one of these... Yeah, I got a knife in the hand. Stab that guy for one point of damage. Yeah, yeah, what do you think you are? Okay. I have a lot of zombies. This is great. This is all I ever want, and no matter what game it is, I just want more zombies. Who are you? A gnome villager? Oh, okay. Let's get this guy. Use some more zombies. Okay, I'll take that. Get out of the way, buddy. I gotta raise a zombie. I can't do it with you standing there. 
You, you used to have your avatar be a trident. I'm surprised you don't have more of a nautical theme amongst your games. Um, yeah. Um, I mean, I don't know what to say. I would, I mean, I play a lot of pirates. Does that count? Ooh, uh, speaking of trident, there's a pitchfork. Are you a friendly zombie? Kinsey. Hello, Kinsey. Okay. Come along, zombies. You can figure out a way across that bridge. How do we get out of this place? Let's follow the road. Ooh. Honey? And a short bow recipe. Can I learn that recipe? I can use it. Yeah, I know how to make a short bow now. Okie doke. Yeah, pirates in sea and space. That's right. Ooh, there's like a waterfall down here. Ooh, fancy. Hey, I almost washed my old body off. There we go. That feels good. Let's go ahead and rest over healed in this nice little spot. Well, the zombies kind of collect up to us too. I need to have like a little nap because I'm getting some problems there. I need to eat some fresh meat. So I'm going to have to kill something and take its body without... Uh, I have to eat its body without taking its body. I mean, how do we get out of this place? Is there a map? I don't want to be in here anymore. I want to leave. Okay, now let's go down this way. There's light down here. This must be a way out. Yeah, we made it. Okay, uh, I'm going to hang out right here by this torch. And take a little nap. Uh, Fizoda? Friendly advice. Description of the threat level on some heroes and bosses can be a little off. Take care. Even if the game says they're easy, peace. Uh, I, I've, I have discovered that. <laughs> yeah, things get a little ugly sometimes. <laughs> okay, I'll take a torch. You know what? I'm going to wield this torch. Here we go. Can we light it up? Light it up. I'd like to see some things. Me and the zombies. Yeah, yeah, follow me. Hey, there's a town right here. So, we're in this giant map again. Ooh, what's that skull mean? Hmm. Let's go, um... Hello? Anybody home? Just, uh, just some zombies walking by? What you got in there? Um, a carrot salad? A trout? Where's Dew Village? I'm gonna slap someone with that. Um, I can butcher the trout and eat some fresh meat. Right? Replace your rotten meat with fresh meat. Yeah, that's what we just did there. Okay. It's really wearing me out doing this. I'm like taking parts of my body, right? That's what's going on here. I'm taking parts of my body and replacing them with this fish. That's weird. That's real weird. Okay. <laughs> it's fantastic, though. What can we do with the honey? Nothing? Carrot salad? No, we don't need this garbage. What can we do with this rotten meat? Yuck, it stinks. You can throw it at someone. Oh, okay. Need a little Chuck emote. Just tie things together. Yeah, I guess I kind of, I kind of do, don't I? Especially with uh, with little Chuck screen going on there. I'll take a candle. The bookcase here. What's we got in the bookcase? Nothing. What are you all about? You are a, a quarter staff recipe and some fish meat. I'll go ahead and eat this also, and I will learn this quarter staff recipe. And let's take these things apart. I'm getting nothing out of them. Oh, I should have. Whoops. Um, I'll put the shirt on for sure. Okay. All right, you zombies. Uh, you ready to go chew on some goats? 70 hit points. Ooh. I don't like that I have to equip these rocks every time. Why 
don't know if my if my zombies level up or if they get better based on what I what I kill, or if it just all has to do with me. B, he says. Okay, so we're gonna go and get out of the way. Get ourselves a. Um, they all seem to be the same thing. Music. It's almost like. Speaking of pirates, almost pirates like. Pirates of the Caribbean. Be nice, goat. Ooh, he hurts. So many of these things. These zombies. It's great. You know, most. Most games. Every time you get to be a necromancer, it's always a little disappointing because you get like two zombies and they last they last for what, ten rounds, you know? It's like ah, well, who cares? But if I can have like a dozen zombies lasting forever, that's great. Uh Don Doan? Don Straw Hat of the Apprentice, huh? Well, let me just tell you that. I really wish I could find a way of getting this thing in my hands a little easier. Oh, I don't have any rocks anymore. I will throw some meat at you. My meat go. Ten points. <laughs> ah, take that. I murdered you with raw meat. That's embarrassing. Okay. Um, yeah, I mean, let's pop that in the old sternum. And uh, I'll put a new hat on. God of Dung, it says. What? Why, why does it say that? Behind my head, you can't see it, but I got an achievement for God of Dung. Okay. Um, take a little little nap here. Let's go... Uh, ooh, here's one of these. This one's going way better than the last one. Little house over there. Uh, what can we craft? I don't think I, don't think I know much. Well, we can do... A, I don't have any linen. I can't make anything right now. Core staff needs... I need a woodcutter tool. It's a woodcutter tool. An axe, this, and it needs five wood to make a core staff. I don't think I care about that though. We can make a bow. Um, I think I do want some bandages though. So if I can take apart, I'll take apart this shirt. I don't want that. I don't want that either. There, I want. I want. Nope. Hmm. Let's repair this stuff. Um, repair that. Okay. The hash the need slasher. What do we have? What is all this? A weird machine. Gnome, gnomes are known for their inventiveness. They make a lot of weird stuff and nobody knows what it does except for them. They might be controlling the minds of common folk. I'm sure that's what's happening. We're, yeah, we're in gnome land here. Hey, little gnome. Uh, what do you think about meat? <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Okay. Come on, pe uh, uh, zombies. There you go. I thought I'd enjoy a game that let me throw raw meat at things so much. What's that blue stuff? It's a plant. Okay, let's look at the, the hall of the gnomes. I have no clue how many zombies I've got. Because it's hard to tell. Because they, can't, they don't show up unless you look at them. This is a an iron pot. Oh, I'll take some of that. A cooking tool? Yeah. Yeah. I don't need to cook, but... Someone might. Right here. Old mud I used to play called the Necromancer subclass. Every time I logged off, the army was lost. Took one to two hours real life to get them back. Yeah. That seems to be how, like... They all seem to work. Um, zombies? Thank you. Can I throw this? Um, I think I'm just going to let my zombie do the thing. Come on, zombies. Get over here. You guys are the worst. What if I say, if I say control zombies and do that, does that 
That just sort of moves him over here, I think. Hey! Ooh, acid spit! Since the presence of all living beings in a 20-mile radius, or bull charger, I'm taking that. Yeah, I'll do some acid spitting. What's that based on? Ability scales 100% main weapon damage. Okay. I will take... I'm not sure what it's going to need. I'm going to take a little bit of dex. In 16 health this level. If I put more into endurance, I get more health. I seem to be doing some melee, though. So let's, let's put some more melee in. Get off his body. I want to raise him. Okay. Hey, green guy. Oh, have a good one, Skull. Thanks for uh, for hanging out. When is um side 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 topic here? When is daylight savings time? Is that is that next week? It's, it's in March, right? For for us anyway. I think it's it's not for most folks, but for the U.S., isn't it in March? Um, like soon. Where are the green shirts? Uh, I'll repair the green shirt too. Salvage that one. Salvage that trident. We don't need it. Wrong button. Uh, I'll wear the boots. Yeah. Yeah, racket. That's, yeah, exactly. March 13th. Okay. So I will salvage these. Because I want the I want the, the linen. I don't want that. Uh, we'll, oh, I'll get the pants. So the hood, I think these are because they're wool. They give me that. Okay. Um, I don't have a weapon, do I? Let's repair this and stick this in my hands. Okay. Hey there, Mr. Gnome. Um, I'm going to spit at you. How, what's my range? Seven? Ooh, that's nasty. How much can I do it? Just uses some stamina. Sorry, Lindsay. Oops, I missed. I hate to do it to you, but she should have seen what I did to the last guy. Okay. Kind of wears me out. Need to rest a little bit. Oh, there's a whole bunch of them in there. Okay, so we got to command these guys into here. I can... I think I can break this. I don't remember how to... So, in, again, last time I played this was in a demo. In a demo, you could, like, smash and walk into things and break stuff all the time. I, I can't do it. I guess maybe it must have changed that. I'm going to wait here for a minute until my until they come around and my zombies show up. Here they come. So, these, uh, these gnomes want to have a little chat. We'll give them a chat. They don't seem to really want to fight. Where does it say that? So, a female gnome... Lucy tired, Lucy tied copper updo. Describe her as obese and unreasonable. She's weaker than me. She's running away. It doesn't really say that she's friendly or not, but the green arrow I think means that she's not uh, hostile. But I'm hostile. Am I damaging the door also? Ooh, scissors. Scissors of the fox. Yeah, a tailoring tool. Okay. There's a, uh, some rags on the ground. A whole bunch of them in here. Yeah, everyone everyone, get in here. And uh, I'm going to do some spitting. Ooh, choppy choppy. Choppy choppy. You chewing on them? Get them. Dar Darwin over there. Good job. I will take your soul along with your body. Oh, I was chopping this room. I never ha haven't had this happen yet. Uh, if I spit, is it going to hurt my friend? Yeah, it certainly is. Okay. Evil John Wormhole and Schnatter. Thank you for the follows. Let me be, he's, he says. Sorry, Stuart. But um, I'm the bad guy. We gotta do more damage than just one with these guys. Okay, what's he have? Ooh, Aspen. What was that? Aspen shield, a feather, a doublet of the bear. Ooh, this guy's got some good stuff. Venomous sword of the fox. 
He's got some shoes. Okay, so we got a, a whole bunch of stuff there. It's actually not that great. Um, I do want the doublet, I think. Yeah, I think so. I'll learn the scroll of... What was that? Scroll of vines. You can also use scroll that allows the reader to cast vines. Oh. Okay. Aspen shield recipe. I'll learn that. Okay. Let's go right here. No, actually, I'm going to go take a little nap. Use a good sleep. Just forego clocks and just and go relative to solar noon midnight. Works a lot better for my sleep. Uh, let's eat some meat here. Get the goat milk out of here. Um, and I'm gonna rest a little bit longer. Okay. Somebody out here shooting, chewing on us? Who is it? Oh, we got. Uh, this is going back into the caves, isn't it? I'm sure I really want to go back in the caves. I could bring my torch out and we can go in there, but I'm more interested in seeing out here. So I, um, I know that. Look at the steam page here in seconds. What was that? I just picked up a primitive axe. Oh, good. Let's look at the steam page real quick. I want to look at something. So, um. I'm curious, like, uh, like what our, our what the ultimate goal is. I think I know. I just want to see if I see if it says what is in here. So um, <clears throat> we're the bad guy, basically. What it says: uh, Someone in zombies, skeletons, goblin inquisitor. World is yours for the taking. Gnome villages, dwarven keeps, hot deserts, massive capital city, black pyramid is all out there. Yeah, we know it's giant. Rivers run red. Kill other gods and change the landscape of the entire world. Rivers will turn into blood. Winter will come. The world will cover in darkness as the sun dies. Consume the souls of gods and change the world on a massive scale. Neat. Uh, I mean, sort of neat. Uh, <laughs> so we take will we'll not come back to life. You can kill everyone in the world and do as you please with what's left. The story of a long-forgotten god has escaped his prison to reign in destruction and terror. Over 100 different abilities to, in, uh, to intimidate, corrupt, or exterminate everything in your path. So all the gear we've got. We can do fishing. Um, there's in-game editors and configuration files. You can quickly mod a lot of new content into the game. Design your own maps, create your own abilities, professions, races. Steam Workshop will be here shortly. 350 alternative regions. So can like them interesting. I don't know how the, how the map adding on would work. Does it just like add into the to the map? So, I mean, we've seen a couple of the things, like Owl King. We've, we've seen, um, we've seen some of the big guys that are out there. And so I want to see the world change. That's neat. Does it say anything down here? I want to see that. Um, let's go take a little, little walk in here. I wasn't going to, but, oh, I don't have a torch. Um, maybe, I'll, maybe I'll grab one on the way in. Isn't there one over here? I thought I saw one re recently. Maybe not. Oh, when I get a torch... We'll go check out inside there. Who's over here? Ah, another gnome. Okay. Spit on him. What did you say? Life was so peaceful until you came along. That's not a very nice thing to say. Ooh, purple shirt. I will take it, and I will raise you. Okay, I'm going to put that purple shirt on. Where is it? There we go. Much better. Okay, so let's go look at our map here. So I'm guessing this is probably the gods. They're probably over here. Plus there's a skull up there. Let's go... So we, we can see kind of where it goes. This goes into here where that torch... Where that question mark is. So I, I'm really curious about it, though. Now that I say that. Um, I don't have a torch, though. And I want one. 
Maybe I can make one. So this is the fox. I'll wear those. I'll use those. Oh, no, this is good. I will repair this, though. Um... Keep those. Start with that. Um, or repair that axe. Not sure what to do with the feather. Hey, some linen. We can make some bandages. Uh, also that. Salvage, I should say. Okay, so now we can craft a uh, couple bandages here. Oh, I can I can make a quarter staff. Do I care? I could do more. Well, one to three damage. That's not anything. A bow we could do, but I have to deal with arrows in. I think. A little rest. Honest, will it? But be careful summoning gods. Nah, I'll be fine. I'll be fine. I really want to go in here, but I can't see. And I don't have the ability to make a, a torch. So let's see if I can run around here real quick, find a torch, and then uh, I go in there. I may have just walked by one, but I didn't see it. What is this? Mountain cliff tr oh that, that's a mountain, right? Oh it's it's is that down oh we're up high. Oh okay. There's a bear down there. Try to explore on the, the map here a little bit. Do I have a candle? Small source of light expanded um I guess that might work. Yeah. Just go in there and see what that is. I forgot I had a candle. Okay, so let's light it. Yeah, a little bit of light. Oh, there's a... Oh, this is... This is... Oh, it just cuts through the mountain. So that question mark actually isn't, isn't there. I see. And this takes us down. Yeah. To the next level. There we go. Okay, let's call my, my folks over here. Take a little nap while they show up. Okay, we found a bear. Uh, I'd spit on it, but there's people in the way. Ooh, I can spit now. Get out of the way, buddy! Is he a mean? Get out of the way! Am I supposed to get the bear if you get out of my way? Oh, get out. <laughs> I just hit my guy. How's he doing? Where's his, where's his health? He's at, oh, he's at 109 health! Okay, we'll stay back. Uh, Arachnus, thank you for the follow. Oh, we got him. No problem. We got so many zombies, and we're about to have a bear zombie. Okay. Who's this guy? Who who are you? You are uh, an orc raider. So we found a few of them. Someone's yelling. Oh, my candle burned out. Who's this? We got Sawyer, the human pilgrim. You mean, you just hit him for 33 damage? You, don't do that! Ooh, electric sandals. Okay, give me some of that. And give, give me your body, too, while you're at it. How many zombies do I have right now? Any idea? No idea. But I got a bunch of them. Is there maybe some sort of character stat that tells me? I don't know. <laughs> There's a bunch of them. I'll take the robes. Oh, they're going to go there. Endurance. Uh, this is resist electrical five plus two dex. These are this is a good shirt. Um, solid sandals. What else did I get? Is that it? I thought I got some good stuff, but not too great. Flame would be kind of nice. 
37 nature damage. And not, not, nah, not really. Electrical 4. This is just everything, though. Now, yeah. Alright. I kind of start looking my look like my friends here, all covered in blood. Sandwich boy. When the workshop is implemented, I hope someone creates a race so I can play as a pony. I'm sure it'll be there. Human, no, the, the human pilgrim. The pilgrim is mean. Is there a dead guy over there? Is that you? Okay. You have a boring robe, a fancy flail, flail of the plague. Oops, sorry, buddy. Okay. I need to find a place to rest. I'm gonna rest until healed. I'm just gonna hang out right here. This seems like a good spot next to this house. Take a little nap. There's enough of us, enough of the zombies around here. Where is? Let's look over here. Maybe we can see over here. Is anything about magic items? Oh, nothing there. So this one it doesn't say like if there's a limit. Twenty. I don't know. Oh, hey, fish man. Ooh, orc. Orc raider. Did somebody hit me in the... Hey, hey, you're way easy there, buddy. Uh, get off his body, please, so I can raise him. Okay, we got him up yet? Almost. Alright. We'll raise him up. Go take his shield and all his stuff. And raise that guy. Okay. Now, uh, I just picked up a really neat flail. Seven nature damage. This is... It doesn't give me the dex, but I'll take it. Um, I see wooden shield. Yeah. Once we get it fixed, we'll use it. No, oh, never mind. Mm. Nothing else? Okay. I never got my nap. So I'm going to see if we can find a house here we can take a little nap in. Yeah, look at this place. Nice and cozy in here. All right. Nice little um, uh, resting place for the poor. Resting place is 115% on that thing. Uh, is that? I'm assuming that's better than, than this. I can't rest over here. So, yeah, we'll take a nice hay bale. We'll uh, rest until healed. I can layer armor in this game. Uh, can I? How do you do that? I can put one there, but I don't know how to do that. It only highlights that spot, so I guess that would be for, like, the big stuff, right? The the, the, the big armor. I just have t-shirts. So if I find something good, I can put it there. This is going to be just for cloaks. I mean, it highlights it where you can put it. Be a long time to heal here. What am I doing? Okay, yeah. <laughs> I don't know what that was. Uh, sleep. Armor on shirts. Cloaks on armor. I need to go find some food to eat. I'm getting hungry. I'm going to have to... I have a, a fish. Can I cook the fish? Where is it? Fish. I can just drop it. I don't need it, I guess. I need to find some food. Some meat. 
and eat, because I'm very hungry. Oh, speaking of food, there's some right there. So we'll butcher this guy. And we won't butcher this guy. We will, uh, how am I supposed to get the meat then? Okay, we will uh, raise this guy. We'll go find a chicken or something. Look to be at a farm. This is the inn. Let's go upstairs. Anybody home? Getting kind of hungry around here. Let's make it feel it would, there would be some over here, something out there. This is just a pot. Someone's over there talking. Let's go get him. Oh, there's a fish. This place burned down, looks like. Uh, I will take that. I'll take that. Can I butcher you? Yeah, get off of him. I can't ever do it. I need someone off of him so I can do it. All right, we'll just hit this guy then. Who is this guy? He's dead. Lethal club. Oh, my inventory is full. All right. Can we butcher now? No. How am I supposed to eat something? Foul target for a zombie. Must be a corpse. What is it? Does he not count? Guess not. <clears throat> okay. Uh, let's drop some things. Uh, or we'll just salvage things. Let's... Salvage? Target target. Oh. Gonna salvage some things. I'll keep the I'll keep the axe. Can I wear that? No. Okay. Salvage all kinds of stuff. I feel like I like being bad. You know, it's all right. It's all right. All right. Uh, let's go. I don't need a drink. I'll clean myself off though. But look at me. I'm I'm filthy. There we go. Now I feel better. Sort of. I'm a little hungry, though, so I gotta get some... I guess we gotta go kill a chicken or something. There's a burned bed. No thanks. No, we're at a farm. Surely there's a chicken around here somewhere. What are you? You are a, a cow corpse. Hey! Come on, what kind of butcher ya? Right? You make a good zombie, then? Craft stone knife. Oh, you're right. Right, right. I completely forgot. You have to have a knife. I forgot. You have to have a knife to butcher things. Oh, yeah. Okay, I'll use that anyways. Um, I completely forgot that was a thing. Okay. So, we're gonna go, we're gonna go eat her. She just is blasting me. Leave my friends alone. Killing my zombies. Okay, so I'm gonna butcher you now, right? Knife is equipped. Knife isn't equipped. Uh, I have these scissors. Will that work? Maybe not. Did I get interrupted? I guess so. Okay, let's butcher. There is the button. Okay. Uh, stop killing my friends, please. I, uh, I'm busy. Okay. I'm going to... Did I finish it? No, I'm partially through that. Okay. Well, we gotta kill this guy. This guy's do so much damage to me. Why are you so mean? No, get away, buddy. Okay, I'm gonna butcher you also. 
You said my inventory is all I need? Okay. I see that. Okay. But still? Man, it takes like, forever to butcher her. Okay, there we go. Alright. So, now I've got... Where are you? I have a humanoid arm. Can I eat it? <laughs> where's, the, where's the meat? Wait a minute. Oh, wait, wait, wait a minute. Come on. I have one pile of bones. I'm a, I'm, a, I'm a bad butcher. What am I supposed to do with a hand? <laughs> Can I eat the bones? No. That's ridiculous. Um, Alright. I'm glad I did that. Heard about you. I've heard about you, uh, human smuggler. Just kidding, I have it. Now get out of the way. My stamina is terrible because I'm so hungry. Alright. Here it goes again. The old butcher. Um, how many zombies have bones and body parts? Oh, must... oh okay. I'm so tired. So tired. Where's that fishman at? He's over here, I think. There he is. Hey, buddy. Gonna, what are you? You're a yeah, fishman. I'm gonna cut you up. Hope you don't mind. Look, can you leave me alone? I'm here trying to cook up. Just trying to cut up a fishman, and you just leave. Won't leave me alone. Did you see him hungry? I think we've attracted the, the village. Okay. What I probably should be doing is raising the dead while this is fight's going on. My guys are all dying off. Nah, get out of the way. I can't do it maybe here. Move it. Okay. All right, level three. Impaired touch, 9 to 12 damage uh, to target, regaining 50% of it as health. Okay. Uh, move up to three tiles back if, if available. Or a shield slam. Attack with a shield that deals 16 to 23 damage. Knocks back the enemy five tiles. That could be nice. It says Fallen Knight, but I'm not a Fallen Knight. I'm a Necromancer, though. I think I'll do the... Yeah, I'll do the Vampiric Touch. Even though I already have that one. This will be good for melee stuff. And I probably need Endurance. Take that. Okay, so let's raise that guy. And we're gonna raise we're gonna eat this guy. Okay, do we get it? A fish? Hey, we got fish meat. Alright, can I eat all of it? Let me try it. Touch. Let's try it. What's it? F uh, five? Not enough stamina. Ooh, hey, that's all right. Dwarves give you meat as well? Okay. Who went walking over here? Um, no, I'm just, I'm just gonna hang out in town in, in this little spot here. Let's go and finish this. I'm gonna rest a little bit, and let's eat these. I'm gonna be all fishmen. Okay, it's doing me some good, I think. Yeah, yeah. Very sleepy though. So, oh, I'll take that. 
Um, if I can find... Oh, there's a there's a bed right there. A couple orcs nearby, but that's fine. Ooh, we're gonna cool down. Orc Raider just deals 33 damage to my zombie named Johnson. That's not very cool. Uh, how are you? You're at 24 hit points. Okay, gotcha. Ooh, the Divine Axe. Heavy as the Divine Responsibility, this axe is the bane of everything unholy in this world. What? Okay. Temporary access to ability judgment. Too heavy to pick up. Uh, no, I don't think that. No, no. We gotta have that. We gotta get that. Get rid of this garbage. Lethal club? Garbage. Lethal flail? Garbage. Get this candle out of here. Uh, I don't need that axe because we're about to get a big, uh, a big axe. Give me, give me this. Yes. I want that. Okay. I'm a little sleepy, but we'll see how it goes. Smell food? I smell orc. 22 damage. Okay, next level up, getting strength. All right. That's nasty. Creative rags of the saint. Uh, the corpse. And we're going to... Uh, I might be able to eat them, but I'm just going to raise them. Uh, I need a nap. So let's go back over here. Let's raise down here for the bed. It's a burned bed. Oh, there's a good bed there, too. 150% on that one. Yeah. Let's, um... All right, let's go there. And, and let's rest and sleep first. We're gonna get rid of this fatigue we've got. It's going much better than my last run. My last run through was basically just me running away from, because I was scared of everything. This one, however, I don't have to be scared because when I sleep, I got my zombies all hanging around. Here's someone approaching. Right, another one of you. What's that? That is judgment. I okay, got 25 uses. Judge an enemy invoking the power of a god. Deals a lot of damage. I'll try it once. That wasn't that impressive. Who else is over here? It's also some movement. Now, let me go finish my rest. Is that my zombies there? Oh. Oh, it's a... A bee? Okay, back over here to rest and sleep. Now, um, I'm gonna get rid of that. Oh, I'm sleeping. I got a lot of stuff here I'm not using. Oops, oops, oops. Stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it. What'd I do? Okay. Let's finish my rest till heal. No, another bee? What is this? I can't believe it. I, I wish there... Talking about necromancers, where you're a necromancer for animals. I wish there was a... Um, talking about D&D. &D. Um, I played a necromancer before, and I, I wish there was a spell we can like, raise animals instead of having to immediately go to... To bodies, you know, raise like little squirrels and cats and things. That's that, that's that's what I want to play. The uh, the animal necromancer. Is there a body there? Oh yeah. With your army of undead cats, or bunnies. You'd be really be feared in the world. Uh, let's go to. So there's a big exclamation point here. You want to go to that one? I want to go to that one. Let's go see where that takes us. I can't move the map any. So we're gonna go. Yeah, let's go this way. 
We got an army here. I'm not scared of things. I'm level three. No, 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 um, no, none of that. It seems like it should be a thing. Spear, I will take you. Oh, we butchered the fat. I see. No, no, we don't. Okay, so I'm going to take, I'm going to, I can't pick these things up either. All right, so I'm going to drop. I need the wood. That's a lot of wood. I don't know wood. I got 18 wool. Oops. The axe is gonna get it fixed pretty soon. So if I if I go and I get my axe broken, that's gonna be I'll make me real sad. Okay, let's do this now. Dragon Magazine had a Death Master subclass, which was Necromancer with factory levels undead production. Nice. Yeah, even even like uh, even D and D is kind of limiting on the necromancy. Like it gets to the point where as soon as you are able to to raise the dead, um, skeleton wise, zombie wise, like it's you're kind of you're kind of beyond that where they're any good. They're like such low level things that it doesn't really do anything for you uh, by that point. Okay, let's go. What's that? A mill? We have a, re a bone bone bow. You know, I'll, I'll I'll take that. You know, might as well get smart while I'm walking around. So I want to come. We're gonna follow this road down here because it looks like this. I can't really tell how far down it is, but we're gonna we're gonna cruise down here, a ways. I assume the the road would follow, but it doesn't. So we're just gonna head south. When I get real tired, I'll take a nap. As in real life, I suppose. Every time you fix it, it loses a little bit of max durability. Oh, does it? Okay. Hmm, okay. What are we at here? Is this a, like a little house? Ooh, he's kind of tough. I should probably should have... There's two of them. Okay, they're here. All right, good. We got a bow, huh? Ouch! Okay, well, it's vampiric touch. Take those hit points back. Thank you. We got some hit points. Got him. Ooh, he's got some leather armor. Nice. And some pants. Some solid pants. Last thing you want is pants that aren't solid. Electric armor. Got a fancy bow. Which I which I I guess I could use, but I'm not gonna. Uh I wanna go. Where am I at? That guy. That guy. And electric armor. And this is ordinary stuff, so this can go there. Another guy coming in. And I got some solid pants. Okay. Let's get ready to chew on this guy over here. Is it a cooldown? Oh, resting. I did a leather cap of defiance. Okay, I'm defiant. I'll take that. That and let's go find a place to fix my my axe. This is not that place. Nice campfire here. Uh, there's gotta be something nearby though. Die. What's the question mark in the taskbar? Uh, that's the tutorial. Let's see mark it all. There you go. So he's right there, wherever that thing is. I still don't know the difference between green and, and blue. Maybe it's like that's easier than that one? I don't know. It didn't say. Uh, 
Okay. Oh, yeah, we're at some sort of, like, fortress thing. Okay. Uh, let's, let's wait a minute. Let's, let's just rest here for a little bit. Fight me, he says. What are you? You are human recruit. Okay, we're at some sort of... Is this, like, a fortress? You got a hat. Uh, a sword of pestilence. Yeah, you know, I'll grab it just in case mine breaks. And I'll take your body while I'm at it. Okay. A little rest before we go in. So, somebody big and scary is in here, apparently. Right? Are we here? Yeah, we're here. Knock, knock. There he is. There is... Yeah, we're in, a, we're in a fort. Hey, there's a forge. Okay. Ooh. I think we, maybe we just go in here and we just sort of let my uh, my beasties go for it. A little lag whenever we get into places like this. Might, I guess because the zombies are causing... We didn't get that last time. Can we, maybe I should command my zombies up here. Get up here. There is an archer right there. It's a wall, I think. A fence. My axe break. Yeah. So I was doing no damage. I'm just going to sit back and let my guys do the work. Um, it'd be nice if I could get over here and let them fight while I do some repairs. Repair, repair, repair. Is this not... That's not an animal. That's just a bench. Where's Landfold? Oh, there he is. Ooh, I'm getting a little beat down here. Okay. Ooh, a nice hat. Um, I'll take that. Nope, I won't take that. I'm a little beat down here. They wear archers. Yeah, they're, uh, they're going to chew us up. Wish I wish when I did this, it would tell me who. Because you can see his name over here, but there's such a list. I think he's I think he's Haddon. Yeah, he's Haddon. I wish I'd say his hit points when I do this. Oh, well. Man, he's beefy. 140 hit points. Too bad he doesn't make a better zombie. Ooh, what is that? Copper armor. Oh, I'll take that. Huh? Oh, too heavy to pick up. Everything's too heavy to pick up. Uh, put that on my head. Oh, yeah. Oh, that goes over my... Oh, I got a straw hat, and on top of that, I got a, a, a cap on. Perfect. Throw that on the ground. Drop this heavy stuff. Okay, this one's broken. I'm using a. I'm using a. <laughs> I'm using a. I'm using a hand. I'm beating with a hand. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Who's that? Jeff. Don't murder the bunnies. Oh, the bunnies are... It's, we're past the bunnies. It's murder in human time. Like this jerk. Like that. Oh, sorry. Get out of the way, friend. I'm getting pe peppered with arrows over here. Uh, oh, no. Oh, no, I died. <laughs> I didn't pay attention. I just looked at that right as I was pushing that button. I saw I had 11 hit points. Oh, man, I was going so well, I could, I could have done it. Got 55 souls. Went a lot better. How long did I make it there? Three days at a time. Three and a half days. Abomination Necromancer. Man. What a game. 
What a game. Man, it was going really well, and that was that was my fault. I could I could have done it. Um, whew, like, oh, replace, uh, all, I guess <laughs> I've always been on TNT and Nook. Um, is that my best one? Dark Dwarf Necromancer. I guess that was from that was from a long time ago. So that was the that was that one, right? The Abomination Necromancer. I discovered three percent of the world region still. Ten of two hundred seventy-seven. Strongest soul taken was the human archers that we got. We we walked into there. Man, I wish I'd gotten there. Cause I want to. I really want to see if um, I want to see the world change. And I wonder if by killing that, if we would have gotten it. That's enough of that. Anyway, uh, it's out now. It's on uh, out here as of a couple days ago. Uh, all made by one guy, except for the graphics. There's someone new, and oh, it was like a vampire necromancer there with the vampire and all the zombies. Um, is that a is that a skeletal champion like a like a bad guy? Maybe. Oh, look at all this stuff. Oh yeah, yeah, it's cool. Hmm. Yeah, cool. Neat little game. 